What's going on, fam club? I just got in my latest order from Pokemon Center Japan where I picked up 10 packs of 151 at retail price. I'm hoping they sent me half a box and hopefully there's a few hits in there. We're gonna find out. I also picked up a Crimson Haze box, arguably the best half of Twilight Masquerade to get us pumped for this upcoming week when it finally drops in English. Now let's get to it. So as you can see here, this is how the box was sent to me. This is the same box, obviously, that Pokemon Center Japan sent to my Tenzo account. Tenzo inspected inside the box, but then they basically just resealed up and sent it to me as is. They probably could have saved me a little bit on shipping if they put it into a smaller box, but it is what it is. It was about $25 to have this shipped to me um, on top of what I paid Pokemon Center, which was just the retail price for each each item the uh, booster box was about 35 bucks and the 151 packs were about $18.50 for the 10 of them half of a booster box so I figure we'll uh, warm up today with the crimson haze I love this set I decided it was the the better box out of what's available on Pokemon Center Japan right now however I just put in another order because a week later it did let me order 10 more packs of 151. But they also have V Star Universe right now. You can get half a booster box of that, 18 bucks for five packs instead of 18 bucks for 10 packs of 151. It's a fantastic deal. So if you're looking to pick up some Japanese right now, definitely go check it out. Get some 151, get some V Star Universe. It's probably going to cost you about 25 bucks on top of that to ship it back to the US but it's still a great deal so Twilight Masquerade drops this week it's looking like a tough set however I was just watching some rips and uh, they got that beautiful leafy on they were sleeve boosters and they were doing really well so I don't know the the booster boxes I've seen so far were doing terrible and um, Love Ball and Ariados. But the uh, the sleeve blisters were doing fantastic. So we'll just have to see how it plays out. You would think that they would uh, distribute better inside the um, Infernape there, inside the booster boxes. But the booster boxes are looking pretty rough this set. Um, so it's gonna be rough for me i think i'm i really want greninja the greninja sir and i would really like um eevee of course i think that eevee is gonna be manipulated like crazy it's going to be possibly pretty expensive right now people are selling it for 35 bucks considering what might actually happen i'm kind of thinking <laughs> Is it worth it? 35 bucks, but illustration rares are should not be difficult. It's the SIRs that are going to be very difficult to pull. So I kind of don't want to pay $35 even for Eevee. I would pay 10 bucks in a heartbeat. Heck, no knowing how difficult it might be, I'd probably pay 10 20 bucks. I'd probably pay 20 bucks, so other than that just because it's such a fantastic illustration rare now I could pull one in here um, so that's why I really like this set it's got Lana's assistance it's got Perrin uh, fantastic illustration rares and we got the Sinistra illustration rare is this the Sinistra or the, uh, no, it's the, the baby version. I can't remember. I'll probably, I, I think I know what it is and then, but I'll say it wrong. And then that's why I'm always like, uh, what is it? Pol, pol, polche, poltecha, something like that. I don't know. Yeah. This beautiful Eevee and I can already see an A spec card in the back. I forget what this one's called. It's not one that I pulled last time. There's Lana. 
Um, so that's good. So it's a different A spec than the one I had. I don't know if I'm going to try to master this set or anything, but I do think got Screaming Tail. I do think that it's a really fun set to rip for Japanese sets. And since Japanese has gotten so much cheaper, uh, you can order a lot of different boxes from Pokemon Center Japan. Um, a lot of the, the big sellers, Poke Japan, Poke and E, all of them have fantastic prices on Japanese right now because the, the Japanese market is just shot way down. And uh, like I said, you can even pick up half a box of V-Star Universe. So Pokemon is is printing it and they're trying to get it into as many people's hands as they possibly can. And um, even, I think, I was able to pre-order, it's over now, but I was able to pre-order the next set, the special set. So we got something here. Oh, it's Caretaker, not the SR you wanna get. Oh well, maybe uh, we'll keep going, hopefully get that Eevee. Yeah, that's a bummer. <laughs> Sorry, buddy. You're not the SR I'm looking for. Zapdos. Cool Zapdos and more Pico. All right, well, that's the way the cookie crumbles. It is a... a oh, sick! We got it! Eevee! Fantastic! Such an awesome card. All the Eevees that are going to turn into all the Evolutions and Eevee. They're all there. You can try to guess which one is which. Fantastic. Awesome. With the Love Ball. Let's not even wait. Let's sleeve her up. Great. What a great pickup. Make sure you do check out my 151 video that I did last. First of all, it was bonkers. Absolutely bonkers. Second of all, there's a couple giveaways in there. Or there's a giveaway in there for a couple cards. Snorlax and Glaceon. So, definitely want to get in on those. Get yourself a few Japanese illustration rares. Got Slugma, Lucky Helmet. Gear of Frig. Well, bummer. I need to get some more. Uh, I could probably just get the cards I want. I think that they're about the same price as a box. <laughs> but I wanted to get go for that EV. So get the E. If I got the EV plus one of the SRs or SARs that I wanted, then that would have been a perfect box for me. In this case, I just got the EV. Dropping Cramorant there. So, um, not the perfect box for me. I'm not sure what Lana's assistance in, in uh, Japanese. I want to say it's like 50 bucks. But I could be wrong. It could be more. It's definitely not. Go it may be 70. It's not going for the kind of crazy money that the cards used to be going for that's for sure all right we got we're gonna get one more illustration rare i'd absolutely love it if it was suey and growlith that would be the that would be perfect and lana again and we still got those 151 packs to rip hopefully we get something there i'm definitely not expecting a god pack but you know, if I'm lucky enough to get the SR, uh, very cool, Blood Moon Ursa Luna, then uh, that'd be a, that'd be fantastic. No, got enamorous. Or, you know, a couple illustration rares. Hopefully in my 10 packs, I don't have one or none hits. That would be absolutely awful. 
That would be really awful. I am I am hoping they just took it out. Maybe something here could just be a, a rare or an EX. This guy is coming up a lot in um, in the English from the pack rips I've been seeing. Macargo. I feel like when I started playing the TCG online game many years ago, the uh, I was playing a Macargo deck a lot. Or he was in there. He wasn't like the main card, but he was in there. We got Glaceon. Pokemon Catcher. All right, we're down to, down to three. I'm still waiting for one more illustration rare here. Are you guys going to go out and play in a uh, pre-release event this weekend? Or, or did you last weekend? Let me know down below if you got any big hits, how your games went. I'm playing tomorrow. This place that I go to, they charge 25 bucks. You get your build and battle plus um, three bonus packs at the end. Yes, got it. Sweet. Look at this card. Look at the artwork. Fantastic. Man, if I got the Perrin instead of Caretaker, that would have been crazy awesome. Awesome. Both of the both of my top chase IRs. Fantastic. There we go. Not a huge hit, but that, that was still a fun box. Fun box. One pack to go. I don't expect anything in here. Uh, I'm not sure how many. I think I got all the EXs that I would get. And there he is. Suian Growlithe. All right, very cool. Not too bad, not too bad. Unfortunately, we got the Caretaker SR, but got some other cool guys. All right, let's go. Put caretaker. This is probably what my hair is gonna look like in about twenty years. <laughs> All right, let's do some one fifty one. My ten packs. I can't wait for my next ten packs and my um, V Star Universe. Make sure you're subscribed if you want to see that. Here it is. Just comes in a pack. I I hope it's half a box so I don't get completely shafted. Of course, all the hits could have been on the other side of the box, and that that would really suck. Let's see how we do. Oh, that's right. I almost forgot. We could get a Master Ball. A nice Mew EX there. War turtle in the back. Yeah, I forgot. I, as I sat down on this nice Saturday afternoon, I completely forgot I could get the, the Master Ball. That would be killer. Especially if it's a good one. We got Starmie. Jolteon. Nita Queen. Not the Master Ball. All right, let's go. The duo, Horsey, Starmie again, Goggles and Muck. Muck. How many Muck fans are out there? Do you guys like Muck? How about Rainbow Muck? Porygon. Oh, I got it. Sick one to pick up too. Kadabra Master Ball. Awesome. Dugon and Hitmonlee. Who I accidentally called Hitmonchan in the last video. Man, when you're nervous, you just say weird. Sorry. Oops, I just swore. I have to bleep that out. All right, guys. Got the Master Ball. I'm So if this was half a box, then... Which I'm assuming it was... 
Then I got the Master Ball ha half. That's awesome. So I don't expect any more. Oh, and I got the SR. Alakazam. Sweet. Oh, I got the better half of the box. Pins are in the back. Sorry to the other guy. I got the Master Ball and the and the box hit. Is it just me or is that one off-centered Japanese card? Super thick on this side compared to this side. You can see his whole hand and then over here it's cut off. So it's probably meant to be a little bit cut off. Very cool. Cool pickup. You definitely can't complain when you get the box hit and the master ball. I'm going to feel really bad if I get some illustration rares in here. Let's hope I get one. Well. Yes. What a fantastic illustration rare to pick up. Pikachu. And there's Jinx. Cycling Road and Persian in the back. Wow. My luck with Japanese. I'm just going to start collecting only Japanese, guys. <laughs> no, I like both. I like both. It's super fun to open both. Fantastic. What a hit. Awesome. Man. You, I still got four packs to go. You, I can't possibly have another hit. There's something here, but it could just be a regular hollow. It's the it's the non Master Ball Kadabra. Or very cool. Electrode seeking Kabuto. Five to go. I'm gonna have to pick up the uh the blast toys since I got the non Master Ball Snorlax, regular po Pokeball, Venomoth, Rhyhorn, or Rhydon. We got Farfetch, Psyduck, Bellsprout, and we got a Tangela. I are and we got Blasty Daisy Hypno Jeez Thank you Pokemon Center you you got me some fantastic hits here Man what good luck what good luck with this set I think I'm gonna I saw today I could get a box from Cali Poke House on TikTok with a 20% off coupon shipped again for about 72, 73 bucks. I can't believe I got another hit. It's Giovanni. A second SR. <laughs> love Giovanni. Love the bad guys. What the heck? This was this wasn't half a box, I don't think. They must, they must just unpack them. And this is insane for 10 packs. Absolutely insane. Oh, big print lines on that Snorlax hollow. Or, uh, this is crazy. This is absolutely crazy. Dude, get you guys, get yourselves your 10 packs, man. We got Tangela, Pikachu. We got. Giovanni's Charisma SR. I mean, I'm just gonna go to it. We got Alakazam's SR. We got Jinx, Blastoise, Mew, and a freaking Master Ball of Kadabra. Fantastic. Can't wait for my next 151 and my V Star Universe to show up. All right, guys, another amazing rip. I'm just on an absolute high with Japanese Pokemon cards this week. 
I don't know what's going on. They even sent me more tissues to try, dry my tears, and I didn't need them. Fantastic. I hope you guys are having a great week. Please subscribe if you want more content from me. It helps the channel so much. I got big things coming up, possibly, so you're going to want to stay tuned. Catch you guys in the next video. 